What is going on, everyone? It's been over a week, I think, since my last episode, and I'm back here yet again with episode number 11. And first off, let's talk to Mallory here. Oh, yeah. I think, for some reason, I feel like we've heard that conversation before. <laughs> All right, but anyways, let's go and continue on here. And in today's episode, we are going to, I think, head to do a packy mission. Well, let's see. Let's go and call this cab real quick. And it's been over, like I said, a week since my last episode, and a lot has happened since then. I've been recording a lot of drone videos and travel videos, as you may have noticed on my channel, such as the Kinzua Bridge State Park, which is really amazing. That location was sort of like in northern uh, central PA. It's it's right on the outs- ooh. Aw, oh, shit, we have to go- I forgot about this. We have to wear our shoes- um, what's it called? A smart suit. Okay, so we're gonna have to... I think this is the robbery, actually. So, hold on one second. Let's go to Pegasus, probably. We're gonna have to go... Yeah, Perseus is what it's called. <clears throat> okay, so we need to be wearing a shoe, a shirt and shoes. So we're gonna have to go to Pegasus or Perseus and purchase this. It's gonna be really simple, though. The good thing is that I could always take a cab. A cab ride back so by the way I'm gonna just try to keep this episode at probably 20 minutes or so just a nice quick video for tonight and before we get away here the good thing is is that there's a, a cab that's always around the corner whoops okay so let's go over here I really don't uh, I really don't care what color it is either just because I want to just get this over with there we go Nice. Okay, so we got a suit. We also need some shoes. Let's see, where's the shoes at? Here we go. Alright, so there we go. We got some shoes now. Nice. I think we're all set. Okay, so let's go and call this cab. And we could go and head back to Packy. So that's, like I said, it's one of the benefits of this game is that there's always a cab nearby. And you could easily take it to the next waypoint, so it saves a lot of time. Okay. By the way, I know I promised a Nostalgia Gaming episode. That's going to be coming out probably sometime this week, into the weekend. There's real no, no uh, set schedule. What? Wait, a suit with a tie. With smart shoes. What the hell does that mean? That's weird. Okay, so I guess we're gonna have to go back. <laughs> Man, this sucks. So we have to get a, a suit with a tie. I don't understand, though, the smart shoes. I forget what that is. I guess we're gonna have to look it up here. Alright. Oh, jeez. Okay, let's see. Let's try this suit, maybe. I hope this is enough. Alright, where's those smart shoes? Let's see if any of these are. Uh, brown loafers. Please tell me they're here. Patent loafers. <clears throat> we just kind of have to go through this and check it out. Suede box. Black wing tips. <laughs> oh my god, this is weird. Hmm. I honestly don't know, guys. Okay, you know what? I'm going to try this, and if this doesn't work, then I'm just going to uh, have to research this again, because I have no idea. I have a feeling this isn't going to be right still. Come on, buddy. Okay, so now we can enter it as a passenger.
Hopefully I pressed the right button too for Packy. I kind of just clicked. Oh, please. Let's let this be the right chance. Oh my god. I just freaking got annihilated. Alright, let's see. I'm gonna have to get a cheat code going. I'm almost positive this is the robbery. Finally, we did it. These guys are so goofy. This is definitely the bank robbery. You know what the good thing about this is? Is that I'm not going to need to... Oh, come here. Come back here. We're just going to take this. Find a four-door car. Oh, shit. There's a cop right there. <laughs> oh, God. All right. So there we go. That was simple. Now let's just go around here. Alright, come on, guys. Yeah, this is definitely the bank robbery mission. I'm super excited about this. This was kind of like the precursor to Grand Theft Auto V's bank robbery mechanics because you kind of you kind of had to play along with what was going on here. It's really cool. <laughs> it's some limey name for C4 that Derek here picked up over there. I ain't having this argument with you, Patrick. Safe to say, what we're using is controllable enough to go through any vault door without incinerating whatever's inside. Not gonna leave much residue on the notes either, so they should be washable. Oh, they're going to be washable, all right. Can't wait to see what sort of kick C4 residue is gonna give me when I snort <laughs> up a line of chop through one of them notes first. Man, Packy is so funny, I swear. Second, it's PE4, not C4. I'm honest about my habits, Derek. You know nothing about nothing, Patrick. I'm honest about me demons. Hit the needle on the old head there, did I, Derek? Expression is, hit the nail on the head, Packy. Really, Michael? <laughs> you don't think I know that? And Jerry was right about you, Mikey. Your parents must have been... All right. So we just have to make our way to the heart of downtown. Don't bring my parents into this, Packy. And we'll be all good here. Ooh. Shit, I thought we were going to get picked up by the cops there for running into him. Okay, we're almost there at the bank. And this is going to be a really fun mission. I cannot wait. Let's make this clean, boys. No civilian casualties. All right, Bank of America, here we come. <laughs> nice. This is super easy to this mission. I'm going to skip these cutscenes, though. But basically what happens is that one of the gang members gets shot. I think Michael gets taken down. Let's go into the vault now and get this money. But this just reminds me of Grand Theft Auto V. Super awesome mission. Okay, so we're going to grab the cash and bolt out the door. Nice. Alright, here comes the cops. Alright, cool. So we got all the policemen on us. 
Now we're gonna blast him away. Oh god. Let's totally destroy these guys. Ooh, look at that. Ooh, shit. God, this is where everything gets hairy, guys. Oh, shit, I forgot about our interview, too, that we were supposed to do. One of the cool things about this mission, too, is that I have cheat codes enabled, so I'll be able to just blast right through this. Oh, my God. Wait. Alright everyone, let's keep moving through the streets here. So far we're at, looks like 11 minutes or so. Not bad. This mission's pretty long too. Nice. Damn, they have people all the way up here, too. Nice. Perfect. That was a nice headshot, too. And we're totally destroying these guys. There's a helicopter coming up here that we're going to have to take out. Let's take out this freaking. We have to go follow Patrick. Or Packy and Derek. I don't know why I called him Patrick. Well, I think that is his name, actually. Patrick McQuarrie. But Packy is for short. Oh my god. Yeah, you also have to watch out because the cops will shoot the cash. Nice. Alright, let's go follow him. For today's episode, guys, I think I'm gonna just keep with, uh, I'm gonna stick with this mission because this is a cool ass mission the bank robbery. Oh shit. Almost got freaking smashed. I 
<laughs> Nico's always the logical one. Okay, let's get to street level, and then once we get to street level, we have to hurry the hell up and use this cheat code. And we really ran through the this, this sewers here, the subway. Nice. Alright guys, but the cool thing is now... Look at that. <laughs> I just saved ourselves a bunch of time. The good thing now, guys, is that we're almost done with the game. We only have a few more missions left, pretty much. We have to take out Dimitri eventually. And then we're also going to have to uh, do some more missions with, with Packy as well. But other than that, we're almost completed. Yeah, it's really sad that one of the brothers got killed, but I guess that's the chance they took with robbing a bank here. <laughs> also, you'll notice, like, in that cutscene in the bank that one of the characters, I think Patrick McQuarrie, he mentioned something about being Irish, or one of the brothers did, and that kind of gave him away. It just reminded me of that movie uh, with Ben Affleck, The Town, because they were kind of like an Irish bank-robbing group. It was There was a lot of similarities between that the McQueries and that movie in particular. Oh god, I almost flew off this side. One time when I was playing this mission, I went off this bridge here because of the stupid traffic. They always like to shift in your lane and stuff. But the good thing is, is that we're almost home free. Oh, Jesus God. I think I just killed that lady. Sometimes when you hit people really hard from behind on the game, or even head-on collision, they'll get out of the car and then they just fall to the ground. It's, <laughs> it's goofy as hell. Ooh. Damn. Pretty sure we killed that guy. Alright, so let's go make our way over to Patrick McQuarrie's home. Good old Packy. Just like that, we're done. Alrighty, everyone, so we got the mission completed, and we made a bunch of money, that's for sure. Look at that, 250 grand. Okay, so the last time we played, we were doing hostile negotiation when we had to save Roman, and now we're robbing banks. So anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching this quick little 20-minute episode, right around 20 minutes or so. Um, actually, almost, not even. But stay tuned for more content. I will have, oh, look, full exploration. I heart Liberty City. That's a nice trophy. But in the next episode, we're going to continue on. Probably do a 30-minute video. And I'll try to get, like, three missions completed. So thank you all for watching this episode, and stay tuned for more content coming soon.